Here is a 5-step process for hand sculpting great looking landscapes entirely in UE4 in just 3 minutes. So the first step and the first tool we're going to use is the noise tool. I don't want to have to sculpt something out of a flat plane and I want to have something to start with. And the noise tool is great for this because it will give me some randomized terrain patterns that I can shape after and have a starting point from. And then zoom out so you can see the entire landscape. And left click hold and drag all over your entire landscape. And sometimes you would just left click in certain parts to apply the noise filter. And this will randomly raise and lower your height map creating your initial terrain. And step two, we're going to use the smooth tool. And with the smooth tool we want to remove some of the noise effects that were created by the noise scale. And they're going to be very noticeable and you'll see them right away. And step three, we're going to use the sculpt tool and define more of the shapes of the mountains, of the hills and the valleys. We're actually going to begin sculpting a better shape. And here I'm not trying to decide where the mountains are going to go and change the height map. I'm just simply using what the noise tool gave us. And I'm just tweaking and redefining those shapes better. So it's more real. So the noise tool was the starting point. It gave us a height map of what to sculpt in this stage. And that's what I'm doing. I'm taking what we have and just making it better. And step four is the erosion tool and we'll begin to define the detail. And I go to various sections of your landscape, left click hold and drag to apply the erosion filter, the erosion effect. And if it's hard to see, press Alt 6 for lighting only and you'll be able to see more clearly on a flat shaded landscape rather than seeing the grid texture pattern. And you will see the erosion to begin to take effect. And this adds a nice realistic layer of detail. And I'm pretty much letting the erosion define the detail for me. I'm just left clicking and dragging and then it takes care of all that detail. Step 5. Which is final tweaks. This is where you go back and use the smooth tool, the sculpt tool or the erosion tool and fix anything that stands out. So this is the polish step. You're adjusting and fixing anything in the height map that looks unnatural or something you may have missed. And here we are. We are done. So this is a great five step process that you can follow to hand sculpt great looking landscapes entirely inside UE4. Thanks for watching and good luck. And for more deeper knowledge to creating and texturing landscapes entirely inside UE4, download the UE4 Fundamentals Volume 2 course. This is the essential beginner's guide to creating landscapes entirely in Unreal Engine 4.